Hey, Big Zuki. Uh, this is my 89-1100. It was a Canadian model, and everything got taken down and put on a 91 California frame. Um, I didn't have very much trouble with it at all. Starting at the front, you've got uh, this, uh, this stay that holds everything in the front. So all of your stuff is going to line up as long as the two bolts that attach this to the front of the headstock uh, are the same width and line up. If that works, everything in the front's going to work. You're going to be okay. And it did for me. As far as fairings, um, the fairings are going to work because it's going to match where this was. The only other two mounting points, you have one here on the side of the engine and you have one underneath. This one is on a bracket and I found it to be about a quarter of an inch off uh, but you can you can make it work and this one on the on the mo on the engine itself actually worked pretty well all the issues you're gonna find are in the back now between I can't tell you about 92 I think they're very very similar to 91 um, this the passenger seat on the 89 is shorter than the passenger seat was on the 91 it's that or they have moved this hoop what happened was I've got a tongue here that's supposed to slip underneath this uh, notch in the tail hoop it doesn't hit it ignore this piece for a second I'll get there um, so I, I miss it it doesn't hold it down the way I fixed that was I had a spare uh, bracket the top of this bracket you can't see because of my fairings top of this bracket fits exactly over this so I trimmed it down and I drilled it and I tapped this face with quarter 20 and there you can see it now so you trap it did with, with, with quarter 20 and that lowered it uh, that extended it out so it caught this um, and that worked good for the seat I decided I wasn't going to use a rear seat because I found a solo cow. Well, no one's getting on this thing with me anyways. Um, so the solo cow presented a little bit different problem. The two screws that mount this to the cross member at the front um, line up for the solo cow and it puts it in the right spot back here. But the solo cow has a hole in the top as well. Uh, there's three mounting points, the two at the front which line up. But this hole in the cowling misses the hoop because I believe the hoop is actually back farther. So I just simply put a tab on here with a hole to catch that mounting point for the solo cowl. I was just going to drop a bolt through there and use a, a wing nut just reach in from the front and that makes it easier to take on and off to. Um, it's going to fit into your tabs nicely if it was matched for that year. So that's going to hold all the top together. The back is where the tabs didn't reach. The 89 had one solid uh, brake light. The 91 and possibly the 92 had a split brake light. I think the 92 does as well, but I'm not sure. So there is supposed to be a tab here where uh, coming off of the grab rail, but there isn't. The tab is back farther over here. You either have to uh, make this tab over out from steel or make a fiberglass tab off the back of your fairings to make to find the one in the farther forward. Um, I had just taken the original ones. I made a small box here just to mount the signals and get my uh, license plate light. But outside of that, that's pretty much all you're going to need. Um, the rest all works, just the placement of this tail hoop is going to make a little bit of uh, moving around. These two holes here were for a solid grab, grab bar for the passenger. The 89 came with the strap on the seat and a smooth tail cap. The 91 came with a tail cap that was drilled on the sides and a hard uh, grab hoop. So if I ever want to put a grab hoop on this, I'm going to have to drill my uh, my spots here and put it over top um, with a spacer. There you go. If you have any questions, uh, reply in the thread or PM me directly anytime. Thanks, buddy, and good luck.